to tell you about a few things going on in our church community. One of those is our Spark Day Camp, happening July 6 to 10. Kids who are going into grade 1 up to grade 6 will learn dance, drama, and singing in a socially distant, safe, and fun environment. The cost is $60 per child, and you can register on our website under Events tab. Our space is limited, so sign up soon. For more info, you can email myself, and I'll be glad to respond to you as soon as possible. We also want to tell you about our prayer initiative. There are all kinds of ways for you to engage in prayer this month. In addition to the Teach Us to Pray sermon series, we'll have prayer meetings by Zoom on Monday at 12 p.m. and Wednesday from 7 to 7.30 a.m. and also at night from 9.30 to 10 p.m. We're also doing a 24-7 prayer week as a church, and you can sign up for a slot in the link provided in the newsletter or bulletin. If you don't have any of those links and you'd like to participate, you can also email Jill or Craig. We're so excited you launched our prayer request campaign this week, where we're inviting people in our community to submit a prayer request. And we're committing to pray for that every day for the next month. You can participate by sharing our prayer request post on your social media and letting friends and family know. We're passionate about prayer, and as you will hear this morning, it is one of the best ways we have to see the kingdom of God break into our city. And there are lots of other ways you can participate in the work God is doing in and through us. To stay in the loop, make sure you are on our mailing list, which you can get on by emailing Jill. Connect with us on social media to stay on top of events. And if you want to participate in our work financially, you can do that through our website or by making arrangements with our treasurer, Brian Lindquist. We pray that the Lord would make himself known to you, that he would fill you with his spirit, and that you would love more and more for his glory. We pray that he would bless you and speak to you at this very moment. <laughs>